She spent a summer building houses in Calcutta, where she met my dad, Sanjay. Sanjay. Oh, it's the dad story. Or mom. Religion was another thing my mom never talked about, but I think it helped her a lot after her dad died. Uh -huh. Mom moved to India a week after graduation and got a job teaching English. Lewis was born a year later. Missing. Someone's missing still. When my dad died, I don't think Mom knew where else to go. Dawn. Who's Dawn? Oh, Dawn's the girl. Wait, who's Dawn? I'm sure Mom. Mom's happy to have her back. Milton Finch in the map. Magic paintbrush.
was for when Milton disappeared. <sighs> Where did he go? the audio by the way the next one's pretty long I just wait I want to do something for my mic Mom definitely blamed I, could, I, could. I think Lewis blamed himself. Thank you, thank you. After he graduated, he just spent more and more time in his room. Lewis is my brother. Until Mom got him a job at the cannery. Okay. Mom, you gotta see up the room better. Dear Mrs. Finch, as Lewis's psychiatrist, I can understand your desire for an explanation. As I see it, the trouble began in January, shortly after we convinced your son to seek treatment for substance abuse. 
Only so then will I believe Lewis first noticed the monotony of his daily life. Quiet working at the camera. Yeah. But he withdrew part of himself. Yeah. In our sessions, I saw the same behavior. Yeah. His mind began to. Yeah. Wonder. Give me the fish. Wait, what am I doing? Oh, go, go, go. I asked him to describe it. He said he started small. Imagining a labyrinth. I'm moving the guy. Then something moved. Bats. Bats. And toads. Give me the fish. And things that have not names. He knew it was all in his head. But he took it very seriously. I had hoped he'd find himself. But he found something more. What is it? What did I find? I worried about him then. Give me a fish. Daydreaming at the cannery. Give me the fish. All right, get up. with his boss but he said Lewis had become a model employee a fish. methodical tireless focus like a whole new Lewis he went a fish. so I let him go on <gasps> what did you do oh, never mind. I even encouraged him it seemed very promising at first. I am in this coma. He told me he'd made a new friend. On the edge of a city he named Lewis Topia. He built the city up slowly, brick by brick. Okay. Then he made musicians. Songs for them to play. Give me the fish. He talked about starting a band. And he was always humming something. Every day his imagination grew stronger. Yeah, you're right, Kia. Yeah. He no longer spoke at the cannery. But his chopping was as reliable as ever. And one day it struck me that all the cheering crowds, even the stones under his feet, were all in his imagination. So then, so he could do whatever he wished. Okay. Give me the fish. He held an election for mayor, and he won. They begged him to stay, but his mind was already wandering. Okay, I can't read the comments and do this at the same time. It became a game. <laughs> okay. He'd conquer a city <laughs> and immediately push on. Sorry, Q. New Lewis. Started drifting away from our reality. I I'm paying attention, Kyo. Minneapolis. Until one day he forgot to go home from the cannery. What? 
Even as his mother pleaded with him, part of Lewis kept sailing on. Yeah, sorry, Mom, I'm working. Give me the fish. Read this comment and I'll give us up. Thank you, Kyo. In Lewisburg, he heard rumors of a... Touch, 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 touch. Okay, it's a beautiful prince. Very good. The prince was on his own quest for radiant white rainbows for sure. Can work radiant. Hand? <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm gonna go through the rainbow. No. Ah. Ah. Oh no. He followed the sound of his ah. silver harp, silver harp. Silver Harp. This chase led him to a golden palace east of the sun. <sighs> okay, give me the fish. Even then, his logic remained sound. He knew the world was all in his imagination. Oh my god, there's so much fish. But he was so proud of how he created it. It's not. Oh, okay, okay, okay. In his own eyes, he becomes even greater than the king. Someone who'd never known success in the real world, I think it was overwhelming. And then it struck him that the real Lewis was not the one chopping salmon, but the one climbing the steps of the oh. house. My imagination is as real as my body, he told me. Hard to argue with him. Where's the fish? Where's the fish? Oh, I'm going home. He began to forget the world we know. I think we're the fish. <laughs> I missed the fish. I think it pains me to remember Lewis. Canary worker. Donano, Donano. What, what happened? He began to despise the man with a royal contempt. Someone's slacking. Not me. I worked till I still thought I could see. of wonder. Quiet. Quiet. Ah. I already died. Okay, okay, Nanda. The palace would be packed with his Okay, okay, okay. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, everybody. Yeah, yeah. Hello, hello. Hello. Including the wise calico insisted on advising him. Big cat, where's the big cat? I can't 
find again. Oh, on the right. Your son was a kind man who will be missed by all of us who knew him. To the block. What's a block? <laughs> My brother was really cool. I wish you could have met him. She waited until the day before we left to tell Edie. Last one I'm story. Not sure if she wanted to make it easier or harder. I wish we'd stayed. Nani, 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 nani. Nani, nani, nani. I understand why we left. Nani, 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 nani. Who's, who's our sister? What happened that night had been coming for a long time. Edit. Who is Edit? Oh, that's me. <gasps> Last day, Edie just watched us pack and didn't say a word. Who is Edie? Until supper, when she raised her glass and said, "To our final night together, and all Grandma, our okay. final nights apart." Grandma, no, you know what I said about alcohol. Some of your medications are very <gasps> specific. I left a present for you in the hall. She's gonna die. Why don't you go home with it? The grown-ups have to argue now. I'm sorry. You're right. We're all leaving tomorrow. Let's just such enjoy such our last. I'm not leaving. Edith, you're excused. Edith is me. The power had been shut off that morning, but Edie always had plenty of candles. When my mom said the library, I don't think she knew about the other entrance. Or that Edie had a key to it. That thing you're afraid of isn't going to end when you leave the house. Eat 
Aegis has a right to know these stories. <gasps> My children are dead because of your story. I think it's best if Edith and I leave tonight. We'll have the nursing home send a van for you in the morning. Okay. This day of the vintage by Edith Finch. Dear Edith, there's so many stories I wish I could tell you. This is about what happened on the night you were born. What happened on the night I was that born? Night, the tide went way, way out. Okay. It was the first and last time I ever saw the old house of aground. The There'd been an earthquake out in the middle of the ocean. They called it the lowest tide in a thousand years. God, it smelled awful. You know, I've seen that house every day of my life. No, 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 no. I never thought I'd go back to it. The nine-tailed fox when the adopted the it. village. I lost my way. I lost my way. Turned around. Turned around. Naruto reference. For I did not while, get. I wondered. I started seeing. I'd forgotten had ever existed. Like what? But when I saw them, they felt like old friends. That night, a lot of things came back to me. Turkuto, Turkuto. Or maybe I came dear. back to them. She forgot it. <laughs> saw great grandma Edie again. Edie. Edie. The next morning the band came to pick her up. She was already gone. She was already gone. After that we moved around a lot. No, 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 we both tried no. to make the best of it. A few years went by. So pretty. My mom didn't like to talk about it. But she started getting sick a lot. The rest happened pretty quickly. Mommy. She got better for a while. alone. Mom. The last finch left alive. Until I found out about you. I'm still not sure what to tell you about all this. If we lived forever, maybe we'd have time to understand things. But as it is, I think the best we can do is try to open our eyes. 
appreciate how strange and brief all of this is. What is it? It's me. <laughs> this journal was supposed to be for you. <laughs> This is where your story begins. I'm sorry I won't be there to see it. What? It's a lot to ask, but I don't want you to be sad that I'm gone. I want you to be amazed that any of us ever had a chance to be here at all. But did I die? Fuck. Why did I die? really fun.